Okay, everybody, welcome back. Um, we are playing Street Fighter X Mega Man. We are on the uh, boss rush stage, so uh, it's very short. There's an E tank you can get, and then it's just like right into like the uh, bosses. So let's give it a shot. Um, so obviously, this is gonna probably be like the worst stage for me. Um, I think the stages are actually easy, the bosses are kind of challenging, so this is like nothing but bosses, so I'm not going to have like that great of a time. Um, we have a bunch of extra lives, which is great. And this game is actually really pretty friendly, in that um, you get your um, energy refilled when you die, so that's why you want to use um, extra lives, or that's why you want to harvest extra lives. Um, so when you get to this point, you can kind of use them instead of E-Tanks. So, um, this is where you want to use the, uh, Tropical Hazard to get up to this guy, and, uh, get the E-Tank. So, just kind of put the, um, ball, like, right on that pillar, then jump up, and I like to use a Lightning Kick, because that seems to work pretty well. Um, Yeah, you can switch, uh, sorry, I lost my control. You can switch, uh, weapons, and you don't lose the weapon, which is kind of a cool thing, too. So, anyways, there we go, we'll just do it, like, one more time. And there's the quick switch that I'm not using, which I probably should, but I'm not. Okay. So, hopefully that dude, like, vanished. You want to wait for this guy to take a shot, kill him, then just cross over here, avoid these guys, and you are into final boss territory. So the first one's Ryu. If you took damage, you can shoot this thing, and it'll always drop a, um, was it life and large energy pellet, which I probably should have used for something else. But, um, that's all the help you kind of get from here on out, so... Anyways, let's start going at it. Yeah, when he starts doing the, um... Spinning kick, like, that's when... It's all bad for me. Okay, so hopefully... Ah! Dick. Alright, that's fine. I don't want to waste the E-Tank just on that. That's why we have lives. So, if he can, like, end up hitting himself with the, um, Super Mega Hadouken, whatever. See, he just goes crazy with the, uh, spinning whatever. Get this thing slow. Oh, I was out of it. Watch her you like end up sucking up all my stupid lives. Anyways, so that wasn't stellar. 
The next guy is Dalsum though, and he's actually not bad, so definitely don't use your tanks. So that actually helps. If we can do like a good job on Dalsum, we can kind of maybe make up for that crappy round. There we go. Alright. So you want to have optic laser filled, allegedly, um, because that's supposed to be the weapon that works well against M. Bison. Okay, so I think the next guy is Blanca. There we go. Alright, cool. That's three down. I can work with that. So I don't think M. Bison has like multi forms and all that kind of stuff. We'll see. So who's next? I think it's Rolento. So good for you. Alright, so anyways, nothing nothing lost. So I guess the soul satellite is really weak. But we're done with Rolento, so I don't even care. See, it's almost like too good, because you get like all your weapons refilled when you die. So as long as you have like extra lives, even if you're like out of your weapon or something like that, it's like totally fine. Alright, so this is Rose. If I can like literally die once for every character, I'd kind of take it as a win. Which is pretty pathetic, but whatever. You do what you can to beat a game. So that's what I was talking about, you know, kind of just like do it on the opposite side. Or just put the tropical thing down and then jump and, I don't know, obviously much better than that, but... Alright, so who's next? You're in. Okay. 
so I might use an E-Tank on Urien. Because he's difficult. We'll see. If I can get him, like, around half. It's a little bit tough to get to the E tank. That would be kind of a complaint too. Perfect. So I think if you get six perfects on in here, you fight Akuma, or I don't know if you need to do it on the original bosses or what it is, but yeah, you need to get like six perfects to see the. Uh, Sagat and Akuma fight, so I'm assuming we're gonna see just uh, Bison. Alright, that was easy. Which means that Rose is our last, no, Crimson Viper is our last person. Alright, done with the boss rush. So I have no idea what happens from here on out. Oh. 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 I guess this is what happens. Okay. Do I... Okay. Okay, so that's what I need to do. Alright, so I have five lives, three energy tanks, and he takes like a beating, so... I'm probably going to... Do a couple practice rounds. Uh, 
Ugh. Okay. Oh, I could just slid under that. Okay, that's what I gotta do. Man, I don't know what they're saying with the optic blast. That thing like does like a no damage. He's freaking tough. Okay. Ah, oh, all right. How are we feeling? Let's do it. All or nothing. Please be the end, please be the end. Yes! Okay. Cool. That is a uh, Street Fighter X Mega Man for the PC. Not the uh, best ending. Man, that was tough though. Bison takes uh, quite a bit of damage. I have a feeling like if you're really good at Street Fighter 2 and know Bison's pattern, then, you know, you could totally avoid, like, all his attacks and just, you know, own him. But that's not my case. So I think the Hadouken worked out well. Definitely save your energy tanks. Have some extra lives. Yo, Zong Hoi So. Yeah. I guess that guy did the whole game, which is pretty impressive. Or not. Obviously, if there's a background artist. I don't know. Those three guys put it together. It's a really good game. So, again, I think, um the classic 8-bit looking, or actually just maybe like the regular Mega Man series, if I was to kind of maybe include this, I would say, um, I think it's definitely better than 10, just because I think, uh, with Mega Man 10 they were just like done, and they had like given up on like level design and all the sprites were ugly and everything like that. Um, so it's cool, I'm not quite sure how I feel about the uh, characters that they selected, um, I think they Obviously, well, they're trying to put some people in there from each uh, Mega Man game, not Mega Man game, um, Street Fighter game, but I don't know. I think they could have picked some like better people. Um, levels are good, a little bit easy. Bosses are challenging. I like the fact that they added the uh, extra mode in there. So anyways, um, I thought it was a fun game. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Just uh, put in the comments. So, um, Thanks for watching. Take care, guys.